Andy Katz here for NCAA Digital and March Madness Men's Basketball with our last bracket of 2022 on Selection Sunday. All right, here we go. Our number one seeds, Gonzaga, Arizona, Kansas, and Baylor. Our two seeds, Auburn, Kentucky, Purdue, and Villanova. Three seeds, Duke, Tennessee, Wisconsin, and Texas Tech. Four seeds, UCLA, Illinois, Providence, and Arkansas. The last four teams in the field, Notre Dame, Texas A&M, even if they lose, Rutgers, and Wyoming. Now, if AM were to win the SEC championship by beating Tennessee on Sunday, they can't be in the first four. So they would move up out of the first four, and Indiana would move in. Yes, you can have two teams from the same conference in the first four, just not playing each other in this situation. If Richmond were to beat Davidson in the A-10 final on Sunday, then Richmond would replace Wyoming in the field. And Indiana, again, if a and lost to Tennessee, would be that team that potentially could slide into the first four because as an AQ, Richmond could not be in Dayton. The first couple teams out, SMU, Wake Forest, then Xavier, and VCU. And as we looked at this, there just wasn't a case to move SMU, Wake, Xavier, or VCU above Wyoming or Rutgers. So on Sunday, there's one bid stealer still alive, and that's Richmond. Texas A&M think is in it just moves the seed lines a little and who would play in Dayton all right we'll see how we do Sunday at six o'clock when the selections are announced on CBS